Okay, good morning, uh, good day to everyone, um, especially to the um, audience that are tuning in on YouTube. My name is Vanj Padilla. I'm a Juris Doctor from the Philippines, and um, I would like to uh, share stories with you about our growth hacking and uh, future proofing of our communities. So I would just like to make a disclaimer that uh, prior to being a Wikimedian, I was also a Google volunteer. Um, I started since 2012, and most of the events and the things that we did uh, in growth hacking our community came from what we did during Google. So we have only um, uh, been into the uh, Wikimedian uh, growth hacking of our um, communities uh, just recently. So for us, growth hacking is the art of achieving more with less and turning our limitations to our opportunities. So let me just share that um, my brain is wired to be a problem solver. So every time I talk to people, uh, I don't know if it's a gift or it's a curse. I don't know why, how, and uh, but every time I talk to people and then I hear them complain, it, it looks like my brain is automatically um, looking for solutions to their problems. So every time someone from the community says that they are challenged with this and they are challenged with that thing or they are into uh, like setbacks and then i will immediately tell them okay let's uh, go to the corner and talk about it let's um, dissect your problem and look for solutions so with uh, less effort we are achieving more because i teach my community members to do the same like i do training for uh, finding solutions so we turn our limitations our setbacks and our op uh, into opportunities. So every time I hear uh, people say no when um, I propose something to them, especially if it's a volunteer project, um, I usually convert them into yeses. Maybe if I listen to no for 10 times, I will be converting those no's into yes for 20 times, so times two. So... Um, I never take no for an answer. That That is how dogged we are in the community. And um, it's not only me, but I'm teaching the younger ones, especially the younger Wikimedians, to do the same because it eliminates most of our problems. Okay. So we use this model for our growth hacking because we started the community with only two people. And then uh, on the first year, we had a community of over 1,500 people for the technology and uh, the uh, volunteer projects we do for Google, for Google Business Group, for the women tech makers and uh, the other communities that we have started. But all of those communities are of free membership, of course. We don't ask uh, anything from the members. So what we do is we start with a... Um, uh, we start with a, not a controversial, but an interesting project or an event. So that's the, the start of everything. And then um, before, when the internet were just starting, uh, nobody is using social media in our community, but we were the first pioneers to learn uh, social media promotion and digital marketing so that our events will um, spread like wildfire. And you know that before, uh, the early adopters of technology are the young ones, so we make it a point to always include the young people whenever we have events, we're organizing, or uh, we're just uh, starting discussions or we are proposing with our partners. So if we start something good or interesting or unique, then we start to attract people, not only members, not only attendees, not only um, those who just wanted to join something uh, uh, worthwhile, but we also attract partners. So we never do any community or an event that doesn't have partners. We need partners. Who are we talking to about here? We have the government offices, the government agencies, the public sector, the private sector, those businesses in uh, the community that would uh, normally give a lending hand or a helping hand to our 
um, activities. And then when they are attracted, uh, we engage them, we give them time or resources or avenues for them to share their ideals also. So it's a like a sh sharing community that everyone's voice is being heard. So after that, um, sometimes we close the deals or sometimes we close partnerships and then we move on to other projects. We cover more areas, more territories, we expand and then we connect network. So that will be the fastest um, fastest formula for growth hacking. And then once we close everything and once we leave a certain uh, project, then we repeat and start again. Next time, we are going to uh, propose another project. So what? once we propose a project, we look at the beneficiaries within that particular community. We just don't bring any project for the sake of being uh, bringing any project or doing any project. We want to study what the community needs and then what the partners would uh, require. And then we meet at the middle. So it's always been a win-win-win scenario. The partners win, the community wins, and then the organizer wins. So it's a perfect uh, model for a growth hack. Okay, so how does one become a great hacker, Ev uh, growth hacker? Everyone can become a great uh, growth hacker. So these are uh, our usual um, characteristics of the growth hacker. We need to be focused, of course, on growth. Uh, metrics, don't forget your metrics so that you know if you're growing or not. And then you will know how to eliminate what is not working. Baby steps, if you're afraid of doing ambitious projects, just take the baby steps. Time management, if you don't have much time, delegate. There are always people who would want to take responsibility. And then um, be passionate. Pivot if you don't have um, time. Okay. Um, with regards to future proofing, um, it's like just preparing your community to be ready when AI takes in, machine learning takes in, and other people who are already uh, doing other things, like um, when the children grow up and then they go work and then they don't uh, edit anymore or they don't join events anymore. Always be putting up your pipeline. Always be preparing your pipeline. So um, always be proactive and adaptable. And then other strategies, um, stay informed. Believe it or not, we never stop learning. We're always updated with current events and whatever is happening on the community. And um, collaboration, it's very important. It's the team of Wikimania, cultivate emerging leaders and then invest in learning opportunities. So that um, is my 10 minute um, and uh, uh, capsulized formula for growth hacking and uh, future proofing your community. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you also to the online audience. Um, hope to see you around and for the rest of Wikimania.